C.R. Cluen v. Flagship concerns a multi-year construction project, an oral agreement, and that ever-popular statute of frauds. Flagship Properties became the developer of a major project to build 20 industrial buildings, a hotel, and housing near the University of Connecticut. In March 1986, Flagship asked C.R. Cluen, a general contractor, to serve as construction manager for the project. After a dinner meeting at which they discussed fees, Flagship's rep shook hands with Cluen's agent and said, quote, You've got the job. We've got a deal. Unquote. Flagship and Cluen announced the agreement at a press conference. They also signed a form agreement, although they didn't fill in any of the blanks. By the time construction of the first phase was completed in October 1987, Flagship had become dissatisfied with Cluen. In 1988, Flagship entered an agreement with another contractor to continue the next phase of the project. Cluen sued in federal district court, claiming that Flagship had breached its oral contract. Flagship asked for summary judgment on the grounds that the oral contract was barred by the statute of frauds. The district court considered the scope of the project and Cluen's own statement that the project would take three to ten years. It found that the contract wasn't of indefinite duration and that as a matter of law, it couldn't be performed within one year and held that the statute of frauds applied. The court granted summary judgment to Flagship. Cluen appealed to the United States Court of Appeals for the Second Circuit. The court certified the case to the Connecticut Supreme Court, instructing it to address the state's application of the statute of frauds.